All right, guys. So, uh, welcome to the newest YouTube exclusive. This is uh, Final Fantasy VIII Remastered. Um, a lot of this game is going to be uh, a YouTube exclusive with uh, voiceover recorded specific specifically for YouTube. Excuse me. I will be here, or I'll be here. Why? I'll be waiting here. For what? I'll be waiting for you. So, if you come here, you'll find me. I promise. Now, if that's not a love story in the making, I don't know what is, being absolutely honest with you. No, she's pretty. This game actually doesn't hold up too badly to uh, modern day. It's not great, but it's not horrible. Oh yeah, the weather change isn't on a miss at all. God, I, the feather turns into a blade. I love that. That is that is a great visual. Squaresoft presents Final Fantasy VIII. Oh yeah, that guy that guy's got fucking antagonist written all over him. Just all over him. Oh, that's badass. I love the hair animation. That little smirk. Oh, they're going at it. Oh, they're they are going at each other. Oh. Protagonist getting the better room. Ooh, blood spatter. Oh, across the face. Protagonist was not happy. Wow. Okay, now that was an intro. That was an intro. It told you all you really need to know. This game is a love story. You have a primary rivalry between this guy and the guy in white, and this this chick with the long hair is going to play some part in it. It's like, it's told you all you need to know. How are you feeling? Okay, I guess. My forehead hurts. Dude, my forehead hurts. That, yeah. You just got, got your face cut open. My forehead hurts. No kidding. Looks like your eyes are focusing. Okay, so no concussion. You should be fine. Say your name for me. Now, again, concussion protocol. Squall, huh? Okay, let's go ahead and keep it. I'm going to keep all the names as is. Why don't you take it easy in training? Next time you may not be so lucky. Ooh, next time you may not be so lucky, huh? Tell that to Seaver. That Seaver won't listen to anyone. Okay, so they're not just like, they're not enemies from across the world who meet by chance. These are two people who obviously know each other. Uh, Seaver, I'm guessing, is the guy in the white coat. Uh, why don't you ignore him? I can't just run away. You want to be cool, huh? Well, don't get hurt in the process. Let's see, your instructor is... Quistus. I missed that. I missed the second part of that dialogue. Quistus, come get your student. Yes, yes. His injury's not serious. It'll probably leave a scar. 
right? Now please come by. See, all this whole, you want to be cool, and I can't just run away. Like, how old is this guy? Because it really sounds like a teenager. Like, he sounds like he's a moody teenager. Well, hello. Is that the chick from the opening? Is that the, the, the dark-haired chick that was jumping into his arms at the end of the opening? Well, hello. Yeah, you could get it. She is not, dude, she is not thrilled to see you in this hospital room. She has had enough of your shit. I knew it would be either you or Seifer. Yeah, she has totally had enough of your shit. It does show you that she knows them both, too. Seifer and the Squall, I think his name was. Yeah, Squall. She knows them. She's familiar with them. Come on, let's go. Today's the field exam. Ooh, field exam. Okay. Squall, is there something on your mind? I imagine there's a lot on his mind. They just... Dude just cut his face open, for fuck's sake. Like, not five minutes ago, he had somebody cutting into his head with a, lar a very large knife. It's not really necessarily a sword. It looks like a, a knife with a fucking a gun on the end of it is what it looks like. Not really. Not really. Really? What's so funny? Funny? No, no. It's not that. I'm just happy. And what the fuck are you happy about? I feel like I'm beginning to understand my student. I'm more complex than you think. No, you're not. You're a goddamn moody, angsty teenager. Tell me more about yourself. Yeah, sorry, but there's not more to you than we think. Like, you're an angsty, moody teenager. It's none of your business. Yep, yeah, she's got you pegged, dude. Okay, so it's a, it's a school? Wow, okay, no, it's a church, apparently. Maybe? I don't know. A city? Oh yeah, it's a school. It kind of looks like a school. <laughs> Alright, now I do need to prepare... To prepare to prepare you guys, you guys might hear some cuts. Uh, good morning, class. Uh, you guys might hear some cuts in the uh, the music occasionally. Um, it's for me cutting down the video to size. Uh, I'm gonna have to do something about the music in the background, uh, so it tends to match up because it's it's almost impossible to get music to match up like that. Those not participating and those who failed last week's written test are to remain here in study hall. I might actually just, like, you guys might not even be hearing music right now, because I may turn the volume of the music so far down. The, vo the, 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 the volume of all the sounds for the game so far down that you can't hear them at all. That all you hear is my voice with a slight, like, a little tiny music in the back, noise in the background. I don't know. Meet in the hall at 1600 hours. I'll announce the team assignments then. Oh, and Seifer. Yeah, there's dude in the white coat. Do not injure your partner while training. And he looks right at Squall. Wow, that's a bully if I ever saw one. Field exam participants, I will see you all later. And Squall, I need to talk to you. Okay, computer. Turn on the power and... Tutorial, the basics about garden, a message from garden and garden square. Tutorial, log in, squall confirm, GF data for squall. Quizicotl. Quazicotl. Shiva, okay, that's an easy one. I know Shiva. The tutorial covers all aspects of it. Oh, wow. I, I suppose I did not want myself reading that. 
So we're going to be skipping tutorials here. So I'm done. Come on there, Blondie. You haven't been to the fire camp yet, have you? You won't be able to participate in the seat exam. I was going to go this morning, but Seaver. Do you have a good excuse? <laughs> not really. <laughs> no, not really. Then let's get going. All right, let's go. If you're not too confident yet, you can review your studies at this panel. I'll be waiting at the front gate, so come down when you're ready. You can access the study panel from your seat. I'm late, I'm late, I'm late! Wah! Oh, is that the, uh... Are you okay? Dot, 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 dot. Yeah, silence. Just stand there and stare at her like a freaking emo teen, like the emo teen you are. Sit there. I'm fine. Yeah, just stand there and stare at her like the little emo kid you are. Okay, so it looks like this place is called Garden, and there's more than one of them, apparently. Um, a tour, huh? Uh, no, I don't really have the time for that. I gotta go to the front gate and check in on Blondie. Oh, bummer. Really? Bummer. Well, see ya. Ooh, who are you? Would you like to have these? My brother gave me these cards. How do you play the card game? I'm thinking this is Triple Triad. I am familiar with Triple Triad. So that's going to be fun. How many freaking levels is this place? Hey, rando kid. Yeah, I'm gonna kind of hang here so it doesn't look like I'm just chasing these girls down. You know? We don't want that. Oh wow! Look at the um, look at the the water walls. Those are th those are gorgeous. Even with the uh, last gen graphics, <coughs> technically this would be gen before last, because I believe this game was originally released on the PS One. Back when it was just called the PS. Junction tutorial. We're gonna go ahead and skip this. I imagine we're not big on tutorials here.
Okay. Out into the world for random encounters. I don't think I junctioned anything like I was supposed to. Yeah, I really don't think I junctioned anything like I was supposed to. That's annoying. Okay, yeah, let's get our junctions done, because we need to be able to, uh, to draw, because that's going to be a big thing in this game, I think. That's probably going to be, like, the majority of the first couple episodes of this, actually. Okay, let's try this again, this time without the oops. Okay, so drawing is how you get your spells. Yeah, I have a feeling that we're going to be spending a lot of our time in the first, I would say, half a dozen videos. We're probably going to spend a lot of our time just drawing. We might end up spending the, our, most of our time for the first couple of dozen videos doing no, mostly drawing. Because we've got a lot of spells to draw. Now that I stop and think about it, we have all the different elemental spells, the cure spells, the protect spells, life, and Sunna. Um, we've got a lot of different stuff we got to do here, so this is going to be interesting. Um, I did pick up that... Um, that trick from the seven days to die voiceovers that we're going to keep these YouTube exclusives at about a half hour, right around a half hour per. Uh, it's easier to cut them and record them at a half hour per. Um, whereas with the, with the actual live streamed ones, there's really no need to cut them or edit them. Um, especially when I'm doing like GTA online, there's very little that we need to do for editing and cutting. Cause I'm not going to put the controller down for any reason playing those games. Diamond Dust. Ooh, look at Shiva. Is that her hair? Is her hair frozen, or does she have horns? I think that might be her hair. She's really androgynistic. Fe female shaped, but in but still androgynous. I like. I actually like that. Okay, and this is the uh, Quasicaudal, a giant lightning bird. That tag was pretty cool. I'll give it that. All right, there's only one of them left. We should draw a little bit more from here if we're smart. Although getting getting experience wouldn't be bad either, to be honest with you. Um, Okay, so we're just going to go the experience route. Um, drawing would have probably been smart, though, considering there's only one of them left. Drawing would have been smart. But what can you do? All right, so we're at the 20-minute mark now, guys. So we're going to do another... Um, 
I would say about another 10 minutes. Yeah, about another 10 minutes. Uh, and the good news is, once I get the hang of doing this, I should be able to pump out four or five of these uh, a week. On top of just the regular, because I usually te I usually tend to render the uh, the full length stream videos. I tend to t I tend to render those overnight while I'm sleeping. These ones I could probably do throughout the day while I'm doing other stuff, because it shouldn't take long to render a half hour video, to be honest. So this is going to be our third YouTube exclusive. Um, I think we did one for GT Online. We just did one a couple of days ago for Seven Days to Die. Which the second Seven Days to Die video will be coming out uh, sometime early next week. Uh, for those of you who are following that series. That's a lot of fun. Um, oh, we got a new, a new guy. A Caterpillar. Which is going to give us um, Thunders and... There we go. Thunders and Cures. Okay, so we got Cure Spells now. That's good. I need Cure Spells. And it looks like that's what I'm going after. I'm going after the Cure Spells, it looks like. Oh wow, this could take a long time. I'm actually curious how long it's going to take to draw a full stack of the spells. Like, how long does it take to do one full stack? When we walked into this fight, we had about a, we had about ten minutes of the episode left. So, I wonder if we can do a full stack in that ten minutes, or if we'll end up continuing trying to get the full stack when the next episode starts. Now we have to cast the heals on ourselves so we can kind of heal up. That's Okay, that's smart. So you can draw to store them or you can draw to cast them. This way you don't waste the stuff that you've stored. That's actually kind of cool. Yeah, I like that. That's kind of cool. Did I just heal her for no reason? I think I did. Alright, she takes seven. He takes... Oh, three. Ew. Okay, so she takes seven again. And he takes... 7-2. Okay, that's good. That's something. She takes 8. He takes 4. So she's got a... I wonder why she draws better than he does. I wonder why. That uh, could have something to do with the, the magic stat, possibly. Or... Uh... What's the other one? Intelligence? Although magic intelligence may be the same thing, now that I stop and think about it. So I think we're at um, we're at about five minutes and counting for this draw cycle. 
Makes me wonder where exactly we are on the draw cycle. I mean, we've got to be getting close. She was getting seven, seven, eight. I mean, we, we, we've we got to be getting close. Yeah, we've got to be getting close. Who knows, though? I mean, these these can go up to 300 for all I know. I, th I think it's 99. But I might be wrong. Alright, gonna heal up a little bit. We are nearing the uh, seven minute mark for this draw cycle. Can you not hit me with your butt, please? Okay, so she's done. It took her seven minutes to stock up Cure. And now she's going to start work on Thunder. How much longer does he have, though? Okay, he's done. So it took them both seven minutes to fully draw Cure. Okay. This is by far so boring. Just so boring. Keep going with our thunder. I might actually just call this episode the uh, Final Fantasy VIII Remastered Episode 1 The Horrors of Drawing. I would skip this and only and only give you guys the uh, the Cliff Nose version of already having all these, but I, I don't want to do that. I want to do I want to do the entire game from start to finish. Every step, you guys can be right there with me every step of the way. Of course, you have to imagine that a a 100 plus hour game aired in you know 30 minute increments. This is probably going to be a 200 episode series. Or no, it, yeah, if it's a 100 hour game. Every half, yeah, it'd be a 200 episode series, um, unless I decide to air some that are, you know, 40 minutes or an hour, um, which I might do depending on how much fun I'm having. Um, these early ones are just going are going to be a half hour. It's, just, it's there's not much I can do for a commentary track when I'm literally doing nothing but drawing. Like I'm just standing here watching myself draw spells. Once I get into the story and I start going through the missions and I start going through the major events like that, I might do a little more. Like that, I might run a little longer because it's easier to do the commentary tracks and things like that for, you know, exciting stuff that's happening. But um, with this, not so much. It's not, it's not easy to lay down a commentary track to what is just, in essence, press button, press button, press button, press button, you know. Okay, so Thunder is now done. So Squall did Cure and Thunder in, thir in in 10 minutes. Okay. So it's about 6 minutes per spell, it looks like here. 
Quaestus is now done with both as well, so we can go ahead and get up out of here. Oh, nice. It really does, uh, the bullet really does come out. Oh, there he goes. He's having a seizure. Alright guys, so that's actually going to be the end of episode 1 of the Final Fantasy VIII um, Let's Play series. Uh, we should be back within the next week with episode 2, so I will see you guys soon. This is the Fanged One signing off. Take it easy.